with uh, Guilford De Benedetto on the People Next Door. You're watching TV Camden, and uh, how you doing today, Guilford? Doing very good. Awesome. Well, uh, a lot of these people. Now I've known you for a little while. Uh, a lot of these people in town, they don't know you. A lot of they don't know what you do. What I mean, you are a multitasker. You you're, you're trying to work, and you're also trying to pursue other dreams. Tell us a little bit about what what you do. Um, on a full-time basis, I'm the uh, Sherwin Williams store manager. I've been with Sherwin Williams for about five years now. Uh, on my my hobby side and my part-time side, I am a professional wrestler. Uh, we every weekend I'm going to one city to another. Uh, that's that's really about it. So how how long have have you been involved with uh, the wrestling? I, it's going on three years. Uh, this this December actually, it's going on three years. Uh, I started in Fernandina Beach wrestling for a promotion called CCW, and as of now, I'm wrestling for four to five different promotions in the area, all going from Orlando all the way up to North Georgia and North Carolina. Hey, we're back to TV Camden. Uh, with people next door, uh, Guilford De Benedetto. Now you've had a lot of matches in your life, but I don't know if you can c any of them can compare to the fan that's out here. Yeah, they, <laughs> they're kicking my butt. <laughs> well. Talk to us a little bit more about the wrestling. Uh, you say you've been doing it for a few years now. How did you get your start in wrestling, and, and where did that bug come from? I guess the bug came from when I was like five years old and, and watching TV and seeing the guys come out with the face paint and seeing the bad guys and watching the good guys go over the bad guys. Um, when I got in high school, it, wrestling really became real, real popular in pop culture, um, and I've been into it good. Uh, I started on the high school wrestling team. I wrestled for about two years. Um, once I graduated, it was like something I really wanted to do. I wanted to make it a goal. I wanted to be a pro wrestler. So I got a hold of uh, a guy named Maurice Williams. Uh, he showed me a couple things at first, and then I moved on to CCW, and that was the first promotion I really started wrestling with. Uh, once I got in there, I, I was hooked. There was no turning back from there, and now I'm, I'm not quite as popular as some of the guys on TV, but in local areas and local towns, y you wouldn't think any different. You're getting your name across, and yeah. uh, tell us a little bit about. I mean, you get to play a uh, different character. I mean, that's what that's what wrestling's not just about learning the moves. Tell yeah. us. I mean, tell us about it. Uh, wrestling's all about the emotion. Um, you could be getting your butt beat, but if it looks like it's not doing anything to you in your face, your body, it, it, you're not putting a story to, across to the fans. The the main reason for wrestling is to it's a man soap opera. It's about telling a story about showing emotions and physical, you know, attributes. <laughs> it's definitely an acting job, more or less, as well. Somewhat, but, but it's, the, it's the most painful acting I've ever done in my life. <laughs> right. Well, actually, we, we got a couple of clips we want to uh, show the fans out there. Uh, you, you're going to do a few moves. Uh, this is you training. Uh, let's take a look. Oh. I'm Jason Payne here, the people next door. We're here with uh, Guilford De Benedetto, and he's going to show us a couple holds. Uh, what are you about to show us? I'm going to show you a basic uh, opening spot. It's going to have a hip toss, uh, shoulder tackle, headlock, basic opening spot. We'll walk through it step by step. All right. Moving herself around. Hold on. All right. All right. What they're doing now is moving herself around the ring with a basic tie up. She'll snatch you right into a headlock. Shoot him off, another guy will pain. Good tackle. Take a pancake and right into a hip toss. Tell us, Guilford, what are you about to do next? Um, I'm going to show you a leg drop. This is basically one of my patented moves I like to do in every match I do. So, here we go.
Maybe we'll get that a couple more times. It looks so nice. Uh, do it a couple more times there, buddy. Oh. Can never have enough. Is it, it's good to have too much footage and then not enough. Uh, anything um, else you, 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 you want to show these people at home? Uh, another one of my favorite movies is uh, something I come up with on my own. It's called The Cold Shoulder. It's uh, something I in innovated here in the ring. Oof. 